It's super early in the morning, about half past five. We're about to catch a flight from Gatwick to Malaga. Now let's fast forward to the airport. My name's Harry, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, please subscribe. And if you're enjoying this video, please hit the like button. We're here at Torre Molinos in Spain, playing the San Miguel, the San, San Miguel. <laughs> We're here at Torre Molinos, playing the par three, nine hole course, Miguel Jimenez. The course is short, but don't be fooled, because there's lots of water, the greens are rock hard, and the greens are also really small. The first hole is 79 yards, let's see how we get on. so I'm happy but my god those greens are fast the second hole is only 81 yards but it's hard because the green is like an upside down cereal bowl so the ball rolls off on every direction
had an excellent birdie on the last hole, which puts me at one under so far. Hole three is the second longest hole on the course at 133 yards, and yet again the green is elevated like an upside down cereal bowl. With my tee shot, I finished just short of the bunker, but I managed to make that super long putt for par, which put me at one under still. This next hole is hole five, which is 128 yards, which goes over water, which is the one we just walked past. an amazing chip shot on the last hole which put me on one under still gross the next hole is only 60 yards but uphill and onto a very high green
so close, just slipped out. That was almost another birdie. Hole seven is the longest hole on the course at 145 yards. It is also the hardest hole with water at the front of the green and, surround and bunkers surrounding it. This is definitely not for the faint of hearted. I'm pretty sure I'm on the green, although I'm at the very left of the green, so I've got a really long cut to go. That last putt was really hard to judge, so unfortunately I three putted, which means I'm back to level par, but I was bound to lose that shot sooner or later. This is hole 8, it's 120 yards but downhill, so I'm just going to hit a gentle 8 iron. This hole has probably got the smallest green on the course, so, any, so if I hit my ball onto the green I'll be super happy.
Unfortunately, I didn't make the putt for birdie, but I still got the par, so I finished on level par, so I'm happy. If you made it this far into the video, I hope you enjoyed my nine hole course vlog par three at the Miguel Jimenez Golf Academy. Remember to hit that like and subscribe button, and I'll see you next time in my next video.